Hello and welcome to this special segment called as MC Pro Select Stock of the Day. I'm your host, Nikki Mirchandani. And in this segment, like always, we bring to you fundamentally strong investment stock ideas. Today's pick is RT Industries. This chemical stock has garnered attention due to improving fundamentals. But the background first, the company is a backward integrated uh, manufacturer specializing in derivatives of benzene. Its diverse product range serves uh, end markets such as uh, agrichemicals, pharmaceuticals, dyes and personal care. With almost half of its direct sales generated from exports, the company strategically benefits from both the China plus one and Europe plus one trends. Now, if you look at the trend uh, per se for the stock, it has a sharp uh, you know, consolidation before the recent uptick. The stock has almost corrected by more than 50 odd percent during the period of October 2021 to November 2023. Uh, now, the disruption during the pandemic led to elevated channel inventory, prompting significant destocking until Q1 of the present financial year, that is FY24. Demand moderation in major export markets compounded challenges and dumping from China also exerted severe pricing pressure on the company, thereby reflecting on the stock prices as well. However, the tide is turning and how, as there is a buildup of tailwinds for the company, the sequential improvement in the fundamental is the first factor that you need to watch out for. Now, the segments like uh, additives, uh, polymers and dyes are rebounding due to restocking. Q3 FI24 export data shows an improved results and disruptions in the Red Sea supply chain may bolster restocking further for this company. Positive signs point to recovery in the key segments. Also look at the second factor that is consecutive sign uh, for long term contract. That's another one which is working in the favor of the company. In December 2023, the company secured a significant contract valued at around 3000 crore spanning a nine year duration. This contract involves the manufacturing of an active intermediate. Along with that, uh, following the success, actually, the company continued its momentum in Jan 2024 by signing yet another substantial contract worth around 6,000 odd crore, which extended for over four years and is with an uh, existing multinational client. The cumulative impact of these new orders or contracts put together is expected to contribute to an incremental annual revenue surpassing a sum of around 1,000 odd crore. Also, ongoing CapEx program is expected to take care of the new contracts. Increasing share of long-term contracts, nearly one-third of the revenue is going to be coming in from the existing, or rather has been coming in from the existing contracts. Uh, another one which is working in the favor is uh, rupees 3,000 crore CapEx brand on the annual. The company's CapEx a capital expenditure capex cycle is slated to reach uh, completion in the financial year 2025 this marks a significant milestone in the company's strategic planning indicating the conclusion of major investment activities looking forward the company has set its sights on the production of various benzene and tolina derivative products also the near term concern that you like to watch out for first is the global headwinds which is related to pricing pressures and elevated inventory and second the valuation let's talk about that is at this point of time it is supported by capex execution the stock is currently emerging from a consolidation phase showing signs of potential upward momentum notably it is trading at a valuation of roughly 20 times ev to ebitda uh, for the financial year 2025 estimated figures the outlook for the financial year 2025 at least on the face of it looks particularly promising with expectation of significant step up in earning profile put together with this it's a wrap thank you so much for tuning in